ways of how to fix the same stain shirt. First, you could turn it inside out so no one can see, or you can do something else with these and this. So, you get mulberries and you get the shirt. So, you get the shirt and you squish it in the mulberries. See how they're all purple and stuff? It doesn't make it stained anymore. Okay, so that's the first step. So, so once you've done that, you just gotta get a real knife. Yep, you gotta come over here and chuck it in there. So that it does not. See all this stuff on the bottom? That's nice for um, getting all of the um, stains out of it. Yeah, it's looking pretty well so far. Nice, nice. Yep. Do that like 10 to 3 times. Top. Just get all, all in dirt. Nice and clean. Right. And then you got to put in a nice flat surface. Get some ice magic. So this stuff you can buy it. Um, like you put on your ice cream, but who needs ice cream these days? So wait about 10 hours for that to dry, because, yep, sets hard in seconds. It's about 10 hours. Just wait that long. I think that's been long enough. Yep, about 10 hours, I think. And then get all this, get all this stuff, like Chinese noodle stuff. Yeah, you squish it all in it into the dry chocolate. Oh, what are you looking at? Oh, it's all delicious, doesn't it? Okay, squish it all on it. Then you need to get the main ingredient, peppermint leaves. And this stuff. This is what makes it good. These two things. So, you get the peppermint stuff first. And oh, there's not much left in the bag. Oh, well. Foodland ripped this off. Okay, squish it all in that again. Make it nice and good. Get this. Hmm. See if this tastes good. <coughs> More one? Yeah, sure. Isn't there some more ingredients? Yeah, a couple more ingredients. The main ingredient. Mm. I can't even read it. Mints something. Has our blood all in it. It's pretty nice. Oh wait, this is the wrong one. Oh, this lean mints. Oh, I need to get the mints in the plastic bag. Oh, you aren't gonna eat any chicken. It's a bit sad. Gonna get like grab your hand in it, grab half of it. Gonna put it on it. Oh, you want some? There you go. Wow, look at all that. Oh, yummy! I'm not vegans anymore. So you get some of that. Squish it all in together. Right. Oh yeah, I forgot this ingredient. Oh, beetroot stuff. Whoa. So. We're gonna um, get the spoon, put it all in. Who needs spoons these days? Nice. Oh, you're loving that chip that pork, aren't you, mate? Okay. And then you gotta get more chocolate stuff. Wait another 10 hours. Hey. Hey. Hey, that stuff. Okay, that's been about 10 hours in the fridge. So now you get it. Get it all into a nice ball. Oh wait, you don't need the spoon. Yeah, I forgot to say that you do not need the spoon. So you can get all these things at like the dollar store or something. Oh, that's a bit of bark. Well, you can, you can have some more chicken if you want. Yep, okay. 
Cut. I'm shooting with the 22. There's no stains. See? So like and subscribe. Bloopers! So get your mum to shoot it with the 22. Shoot. <laughs> Where are you? Oh, Bloopers. Shoot. <laughs> First, you, you've got to get some mulberries in a bowl like this. And then, what? Yes. <laughs> Okay, 